HMS Prize, under the command of New Zealander William Saunders, successfully repelled an attack from German submarine U-93, which sank after being hit by a shell at close range. The sub's commander was rescued and the U-boat thought to have been lost. However, the second in command was able to regain control over the stricken sub and bring it safely back to Germany. French submarine building picked up speed after the war, and the country developed the Redoutable class. These vessels were designed for long patrols with a range of 14,000 nautical miles, traveling at seven knots above water and 90 nautical miles submerged. Powered by two diesel 4,300 horsepower and two electric 1,200 horsepower engines, the subs could submerge to a depth of 80 meters and had a top speed of 17 knots. They were 92 meters in length and carried an array of armaments, including 11 torpedo tubes and two 13.2 millimeter machine guns. The 1,500-ton subs could carry a crew of 79 men and five officers. Submarines from this class included the Actaeon, launched in 1929. This vessel was later pressed into service by the Vichy French administration and sunk by British destroyer HMS Westcott off the coast of Algeria during the Allied invasion of North Africa in 1942. There were no survivors. Type 1 of the Redoutable class were oceanic submarines, Type 2 were coastal, and Type 3 were mine layers. Many saw action in the Second World War, but only four survived the conflict. Further additions to the Redoutable class included twin subs Le Hero and Le Centaur, which were launched amid great fanfare in 1932. Another Redoutable class vessel was the Casabianca, launched in 1935. When France fell to the Germans in 1941, she was disarmed, but her captain hid fuel on board and secretly restored the weapons. In 1942, when the Germans invaded Toulon Harbor, the Casabianca fled under heavy German fire and managed to escape to Algiers, where she joined the Allied fleet. She carried out missions for the Allied secret services and was dubbed the Phantom Submarine by frustrated German troops. 